hello guys and welcome to another tutorial video and in this short tutorial video i'll be showing you how to stake manta network it's easy to get your manta token staked on their network once you've logged on to the manta.network platform simply scroll down till you find add manta pacific to metamask so guys to add the manta pacific network to metamask click on this option here and by doing that your metamask app or wallet would then be opened up prompting you to connect to the site and get the network on your metamask now if you do not have the manta pacific network on your metamask once it's loaded up click on the network toggle at the top left once you selected the network toggle at the top left corner of the screen simply scroll and if you can't find the manta pacific mainnet click on add network now by selecting the add network option so guys simply click on add the network manually to add the manta pacific network and where we have the network name rpc chain id and symbol you can get all this information from chainlist.org when you use our link and connect to the manta pacific mainnet so all you need to do is simply connect your wallet and all this information would be entered across the board and all you need to do is click on save and once you've done that, once you've gotten the Manta network on your wallet, the next option would be to add the Manta token, which is the native token of the Manta network. That's the Manta Pacific network, native token of the Manta Pacific network, which is this Manta here. If you can't find the tokens manually, all you need to do is click on import tokens and enter the token contract address and symbol, which you can be getting from the website pacific explorer dot manta dot network and this is the contract address for the token which is here so once you click on copy the current the contract address you could simply add the token to your wallet so click on the import tokens option remember we just copied this address so once you've copied it simply paste the contract address there once you've entered the token decimal you have manta simply click on next and click on import as you can see your balance would be shown and don't forget guys you could easily deposit your manta tokens here by simply using the deposit option and depositing from a centralized exchange all you need to do is simply copy your wallet address which is here and deposit from a centralized exchange like binance okx kucoin you could easily get your manta tokens from those exchanges and onto the metamask platform once you've added the Manta token and you've gotten your Manta network available. So the next step to staking your Manta tokens is really easy. Click on Bridge to Atlantic. As if you remember, we just added the Manta Pacific network on our wallet and we funded via a centralized exchange. But another option of funding is bridging directly from the Ethereum mainnet to the Manta Pacific mainnet. All you need to do is connect your wallet and by connecting your wallet, you get to move from the Ethereum mainnet to the Manta Pacific mainnet alongside your Ethereum tokens and you could deposit Manta tokens from a centralized exchange. So guys, you've gotten your Manta tokens, you've gotten your Manta Ethereum, which you bridged from the Ethereum network or you deposited from a centralized exchange. Your next step to staking is pretty easy. Click on Bridge to Atlantic and once you select Bridge to Atlantic, so guys, once you're on the Manta bridge, all you need to do is simply move your Manta Pacific tokens from the Manta Pacific network to the Atlantic network. If you remember, for the Manta Pacific network, we were working with the EVM wallet being the MetaMask wallet. For the Manta Atlantic network, you're going to need a Talisman wallet, which is this wallet over here. So make sure you set up a Talisman wallet because the Talisman wallet is a Polkadot wallet and the Manta Pacific net, the Manta Atlantic network is built on the Polkadot network. So make sure you have a talisman wallet, and this talisman wallet is what we're going to be using for bridging and staking of our Manta tokens. So please make sure you have some Manta Pacific Ethereum. The Manta Pacific Ethereum is needed to perform this transaction. So click on connect wallet. Once you've selected connect wallet, connect your MetaMask wallet and also your talisman wallet to the site so click on metamask so guys once you selected the metamask all you need to do is simply connect to the manta network bridge page 
by simply accepting or clicking on connect. Once you've connected, your Manta Ethereum, being the Manta Pacific Ethereum, would then be used to cover the gas fees. So make sure you've gotten yourself some of the Manta Pacific Ethereum. And then your Manta tokens can be bridged from the Pacific network to the Atlantic, which is making use of your MetaMask wallet and your Talisman wallet at the same time. So make sure your wallet is connected. Once you've connected your wallet, that's both the Talisman and the MetaMask, and you've bridged from the Pacific to the Atlantic, the next step would be to stake your Manta tokens to secure the network and earn rewards. So click on the staking option. So guys, once you're on the Manta staking platform, simply connect your wallet to begin staking. And with your wallet connected, simply scroll down and you'll find the list of collators. These are validators that you can stake your Manta tokens with. And now all you need to do to begin staking is take note that the minimum amount to stake is 754 Manta tokens. So you must have up to 754 Manta tokens and some Pacific Manta Pacific Ethereum to cover your gas fees. Note that this Manta is Manta on the Atlantic network. So you must have this Manta in your Polkadot wallet. As it says here, your Polkadot wallet, your sub wallet or talisman wallet must be connected to see your balance and rewards. So you could simply connect your talisman wallet, your Polkadot wallet to receive your rewards. So guys, you're connected. How can you start staking? The next step is to simply click on the stake option beside the delegators. As you can see, there's a limit for delegation, which is 100, but it's been boosted up to about 150 or more. And now all you need to do to join is click on stake. And once you select that stake, all you need to do now is enter an amount of Manta tokens you wish to connect. So let's say you've got 755 Manta tokens. All you need to do is simply click on the stake option and you get to stake your Manta tokens with the anonymous validator. And after some time, you, you begin to get your rewards right in your Polkadot wallet, which is your Talisman wallet or your sub wallet or the Polkadot.js wallet. So guys, do comment down below if you have a question concerning how to stake Manta network and you'd be given an answer. Thank you.